الثورة تقرر الآتي أولا إعلان حالة الطوارئ في جميع أنحاء البلاد In just half a century, people stood three times to record in history that the Sudanese people refuse to be led by an individual or a group which doesn't believe in freedom, peace, and equality. We're stressing here that the armed forces intend to complete the democratic transition until the country's leadership is handed over to an elected civilian government who can bring these issues to life. This is our country, and conflict between its institutions can threaten the unity and security of the country. And this is what Prime Minister Abdullah Hamdak stressed in the initiatives he launched in July and October this year.